Hello, I'm Alan Beaton, head mixologist for Phantom and Soft Drinks. I'm down here in Soho mixing some perfect serves with Anik Gin and Fentiman's Mixers. Anik Gin possesses some really nice herbaceous floral qualities such as lavender and rosemary and coriander. Uh, that mixes really well with rose lemonade. Rose lemonade has got the juice of one and a half lemons in it, so it's quite citrusy, but it's also got a really potent floral note with the pink rose oil that comes from the rose petals that we get in Kazanlak Valley in Bulgaria. So we're gonna pour a double measure of the Anik Gin over a stack of ice in the high bowl. So we just drop that one in there, and then we're gonna pour down the rose lemonade. I'm gonna use around about three quarters of the rose lemonade because it is quite a, a powerful, punchy mixer. So we don't wanna use it all and sort of overpower the gin. Um, as we can see, the liquids just drop down in the glass a little bit. To stack that back up, just so we can put a nice fa fancy garnish on the top of the glass, I'm just gonna pop a little bit more ice in there. Hopefully just a little bit smaller. Isn't being my friend today. Okay, so from there, we're gonna use some grapefruit peel, but we're gonna try and do something a little bit fancy. If you shave the grapefruit peel, but just try and take a thin layer off the top, just skim it round, try and avoid taking too much of the pith. And you're gonna go around about half of the grapefruit, not too much. So that should probably do us around about there and just cordon that off. Um, I have taken a little bit too much pith in the middle there, so I'm just gonna scrape it with the knife. Just take that off, just so it's easier to, to make a nice fancy twist with. So we take that off the side. Then I'm gonna trim so it's straight right down the outside. You're taking all the untidy bits off. And if you spin it back around and do the same with the other side, trimming it right down so you've got a nice thin, straight line of peel and discard that stuff out of the way. Sorry. Then all we're gonna do is, we're just gonna twist the grapefruit peel in on itself and sort of layer it upwards. So I'll try and show you what I mean as I'm going here. That one's twisted in, and we gradually move it round like that, just fiddling it round in your fingers. It is a little bit fiddly, but when you get it right, it does have a nice sort of garnish for the top of the glass. So if you twist it round like so, and then just pop it through, and we're gonna take a cocktail stick, PS one side, and go right through the other side. So we've got it in the middle. So we've got that on there. Next, tell you what, we'll top that up a little bit with rose lemonade. Next, we stick the basil just in the top so it sits delectably. And then we pop the rose just in beside it. And then hopefully, as you can see, it's a bit like a rose petal. Alongside it, you've got your Anik Gin, Rose Lemonade. It is a little bit different for people who don't like tonic water, this is a great serve. Nice and sweet, citrusy, floral, all things different, but great one to try on the weekend if you're making drinks at home or if you're out in a bar. Do enjoy the perfect serve.